let x equal to x y be the solution of the differential equation this so this differential equation can be solved either using homogeneous or we can use exact differential equation i'm using exact this time you can go for homogeneous also so when you take lcm over here it will be x dy minus y dx divided by dy that you can do the cross multiplication so we'll have y dy over here and multiplied by sin x by y now we know that when we have this type of term x dy minus y dx we need to divide by x square or y square in denominator but keeping right side in mind if we'll divide by x square then it will be a problem in differentiating so we'll divide by y square so that gives us lhs as dy by y rhs as this term which is differentiation of x by y it may be negative of it so that we have to look into using division rule of differentiation so when you go for d of x by y using division rule it should be y dx first but it is negative of that so you apply negative over here negative dx by y into sin x by y and just put the integration on both sides and then done so that is called exact differential equation now when you integrate one by y it will be ln mod y and this is like sin t dt and negative is outside so integration of negative sin t is cos t and then you apply integration constant plus c now they have given x0 sorry x1 is equal to pi by 2 means input is 1 output is pi by 2 here x is output and y is the input so y is 1 and x is pi by 2 ln 1 is 0 x is pi by 2 cos pi by 2 is also 0 so we got the value of c as 0 now we are looking for cos of x2 cos of x2 means we need the input y value to be 2 put y is equal to 2 and you will get the value of x so putting y equal to 2 this will be ln 2 this will be cos of x whose input is 2 divided by 2 and this is 0 so basically you got cos theta by 2 and now you have to find cos theta so cos theta in terms of cos theta by 2 it's kind of cos 2a is equal to 2 cos square minus 1 basic common trigonometry so we can write it as 2 cos square theta by 2 if you're considering this angle is theta minus 1 and just plug the value of cos x by 2 which is ln 2 so answer to be 2 ln 2 whole square minus 1 let's check the answer what is given answer is given as option b which is 2 ln 2 whole square minus 1 and we are also getting the same thing